happy Monday. Glass half full kind of day. Well, glass half full kind of conversation we're gonna have. Crazy weekend. We had our Q&A, first time back after Moo. That was a rough one. Three hours, you guys are amazing. Did we get it all right? We got it right. I think we did it. I think we did. I think we did it. We're trying to figure it out. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of purple. That's a lot of purple. That's hearts, a lot guys. of purple. I'd have to say for one, like <laughs> clicking that live button, I got the little, heart fluttering. I got a little nervous there for a minute. Like, I don't remember how to do this. Oh gosh, is that glitchy? Remember, Maybe this TV is not the best. And yeah. we'll have to wait for everybody to stop with the purple. <laughs> <laughs> Stop with the Double thumbs hearts. up. Can you hear us? Can you see us? That's yeah. Uh, that's how we started all the that's time. That's what we need to know. For people, we could have gone longer than three hours. I think Winnie and Winston helped us out by cutting it short, being like, "Guys, this is enough. Three hours, we're good. We got it out. We talked it through. We cried a little. We laughed a little. We all had a good time. Um, we were all together to go through that process, which was necessary. And I think in the end, it helped. I know it helped a lot of you, and I think in the end, it definitely helped us. Uh, Jace was here, you know, passed out on the couch just like normal, like he normally does. We did a lot of work. We cleaned the garage. Take a look. We cleaned it. We even scrubbed and squeegeed the floor to the point where I didn't realize I had a crack in my cement. And now we know. But I mean, we cleaned the garage. We'll talk about the couch in a minute. But like we cleaned it. Cleaned and cleaned and cleaned. Because of the whole hay situation, which I don't think we've talked about yet because I'm skipping videos. We're bringing in hay from another vendor and it's coming with its own trailer. That's pretty much what's happening. They're bringing a trailer stuffed with hay. We're going to use it. When the trailer's empty, they're going to take it and bring us. It's called drop ship or drop trailer that's coming soon. So we cleaned it. The boys have been working on green machine. They've been working on their lawnmower. They've been working on stuff. So we just needed the place to be more functional in here. And we had that old couch. It's like 20 years old. Uh, Liz and I bought that when we got together and moved into our condo pre-marriage. The most comfortable couch ever. And now it's in the garage because we really have had it like tucked in the corner of a hallway because we didn't want to get rid of it. And it now has wheels on it. See, it has wheels on it right there. That way we can move it around. When we have to get into the freezer, we can just roll it. The kids can roll it over this way, over here. Somebody can be working on a dirt bike. Somebody else can be sitting on a couch playing video games on their phone, whatever. They can all have a good time. Um, or they can do things like this. Don't crash, don't crash them, oh my goodness. This is what happens when I spend all day cleaning the garage, turn it into a man cave, and you guys get Piper and Stella dizzy. You okay? You guys okay? They're good. Tyler, are you all right? I would try to hold, I to hold Piper and she just, Blew out of my hands. Yeah, that was funny. Um, Mom, Tyler, Piper, and Stella on a couch with wheels. Entertaining. So the other thing I want to talk about is what happened Sunday morning when Dad here decided to rush the process. So we have a procedure, right? The babies get milk bottles at 6, 9, 1, 6, 9, I think. Those are the times, whatever. So nine o'clock is their milk time, but it was Sunday and we were running late. We didn't get out to the barn until about 9.20. So I was like, let me give them their bottle first and then we'll do barn chores. Normally we do the barn chores and then they get their bottles. But I rushed it because I was like, we're running behind. And that went wrong. So because I rushed it, well, which I didn't think I was rushing, but I fed them and I forgot to close the gate. I didn't forget to, I tried to close the gate, didn't realize it didn't latch, and then this happened.
Okay, this is the whole perspective thing. It's the whole glass half full. It could have gone way worse. I still feel bad for all the bad words. I actually do have a potty mouth and I try to keep that clean on YouTube. But uh, it hurts right here. It hurts still, it's still a little swollen. And um, you know, it could have been way worse. Way, way worse. A, it could have been Liz. I mean, not getting hit inside of the face with a two by four with a goat on the, I mean, that's like somebody hitting you in the head with a baseball bat, pretty much. I'm glad I took the fall. That's my point. And I'm glad it hit me right here, solid temple, and not eye, socket, jaw, a little lower, jaw, ear, anywhere else in this vicinity would have hurt way worse. So it's, it's good. I'm actually recording this on Sunday night, like only 12 hours after it happened. So this will be the first time I lay down. I'm a little worried about that. The blood will rush to my head and it might start hurting again, but we'll see. This is it. I did not expect to make this video. It's just been a wild, crazy weekend. Thank you all for sticking with us during that Q&A. Thank you all for sticking with us in general. And yes, we now have a couch in our garage with wheels on it. I mean, it, we, we can't get much sillier than that. So Goat Snuggles coming up in about a week. We might actually see some of you here. Um, have a good night. Bye. Or good day, because you're watching this early in the morning, so I didn't mean to say that. So, whatever. Bye. That hurt. Oh, my God. I think I got lucky. Yep. I couldn't clean it with the freaking beard. No stitches. Oh my god, the freaking oh the room is spinning though. Ooh. Oh man. I hope my glasses are okay. I don't know what happened. Obviously I went in there, fed the babies, came out. I guess the latch didn't latch right. It's my fault. It, uh,